Hey, I got my stuff. So do you know what that means? Let's play the transgender topic intro. Behind me, I have got four products, which include Suda Cream, Honey, Toothpaste, and of course, Ice. These four products are the products of which I use on a weekly basis to get rid of my spots. Things like this ruin my confidence on a daily basis. If you're trying to pass as MTF, there's a stereotype of girls being less spotty, and for girls to also have very soft, smooth skin. So today we're going to be talking about spots prevention. How to get rid of these things. The first thing I advise you to do once you notice a spot is to pop it straight away. Because trust me, one of these four methods will make it much better. Once you've popped the spot, you need to get rid of the spot liquid ASAP. And for that I recommend Cleaning Clears a Deep cleansing lotion. And you're going to need some cotton buds as well. Careful does it, careful does it, oh, oh, there we go, oh lovely. And once you've got your moistened cotton bud, just dab it on like so. I recommend getting ice on the areas of which your spot is on. Ice is one of the four things that I'm going to be talking about in this video. Now ice is amazing for getting rid of redness and the swelling in spots. The next item I recommend you people putting on your spots is toothpaste. Yes, that is correct. I recommend using toothpaste. Toothpaste is amazing for getting rid of spots because it really helps dry out the spot. Don't ask me why though, because I have no idea why it's so good at drying out the spot. You can pretty much use any sort of toothpaste. I'm just using the cheapest one that I could find. The next product that I recommend you putting on your spots is honey. Now, honey is amazing at being a natural antiseptic. In simple English, that practically means that it gets all the bugs out of the wound and makes it very, very nice and protected. Uh, oh wait, we're doing spots, okay. Now any honey really does this quite well because most honeys in the world are natural. The honey that I am using is this honey. Now this tastes amazing, especially on porridge. Like, do you watch my daily vlogs? I make daily vlogs as well on this channel. If you watch my daily vlogs, you know that I love my honey and my porridge. The final product is, of course, Suda Cream. Now, I've done hundreds of videos, quite literally hundreds of videos on Suda Cream, but this stuff is amazing. Anything which is an open wound, this, this is great. I put this on not only because it heals the wound quick, but because you got toothpaste and honey, it tastes quite good. The last thing you want is someone trying to- Can make I you. lick you, please? Can I lick you? For me personally, I like to apply a lot of Suda Cream just because you want to get the surrounding area as well as the main wound area. Now you may be thinking, what do I do next after I applied the four products? Well, you have to wait for about half. It has been exactly half an hour, plus a little bit more, therefore not exactly, but you get the gist. So that means it's now to uncover this. Let's see how amazing it looks. For the cream removal process, I'm going to be using the Clean Clear product. And in three, two, one. Now already you can tell how well it has worked. Does this look much better than what it looked like? You can repeat this process as many times as you want. You can leave it on longer, but it's best to wipe it off every half an hour. But I hope you have learned something in this video today. So if you have, a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And on that note, good bye. It's time to say goodbye I had so much fun And you had so much fun